Hello, my name's Loretta Minghella and I'm the Chief Executive of Christian Aid. In April 2012, we launched our most ambitious corporate strategy ever, Partnership for Change. It sets out the five fundamental shifts in power we think are necessary in order to eradicate poverty. And with your support, we're off to a fantastic start. Over the past year, we've helped millions of people in some of the poorest places in 45 countries across the world. In this short film, which accompanies our latest annual report, we look back over some of the achievements of the past year and remind ourselves that when we pull together, transformational change is possible. A campaigns officer at Christian Aid. From August to October last year, we ran a seven-week tax justice bus tour that took our campaign messages across the length and breadth of the UK and Ireland. The tour was a great success. Along the way, we met with 5,500 supporters, had meetings with over 70 politicians and 100 church leaders.
The IF campaign is simply saying there are a few very basic steps that can be taken, a few ways in which we can really push our leaders, our politicians, to make this happen in our lifetime. I'm really very proud that Christian Aid is a big part of what's happening. That was a small taste of all that we've achieved together over the past year. If you'd like to find out more, you can always look on our website where you'll find our latest annual report, or look out for the autumn edition of Christian Aid News. And finally, a word of thanks. Whether you're a volunteer, a supporter, a member of staff, a partner, whatever part you've played in the Christian Aid movement, thank you for everything that you've done. It wouldn't have been possible without you. And I pray that you'll stay alongside us in the really busy year ahead. We will continue to respond to the crisis in Syria. We'll be launching the next phase of our tax campaign. We'll be getting ready for our 57th Christian Aid Week. Together, we can build a world which reflects the dignity of every person, each one made in the image of God. Thank you.